All right. Oh, the ghetto. Ooh. Y'all ask for story times? So I'm gonna give it to you. You can barely see my buns. I look bald. <laughs> Hey guys, it's your girl Malaya the Player back with another video, and today I'm going to be filming a story time. Got me shake some. She got a bun in the oven, still a bake some. You know what happened? She was classy. We done turned her to a rat. Now the bitch suck dick till the day done. Oh, Peter Piper. The baby mama fucking squad and she excited. And this story time is gonna be about my first kiss. And only like one person out of all my friends heard this story, but that's because I don't really count it as like a kiss, you know? Like. It was just a little peck or whatever. Like at the same time, I still locked lips with this boy, bro. I had my first kiss with a white boy. Like, who would have thought, bro? Oh my God! Wow! This was in seventh grade, right? And I low-key had a crush on one of my friend's boyfriends. And it was like a close friend. I'm not even gonna say too much because she don't even know that this happened. I tell you I was unfaithful to my friends. I was unfaithful, okay? This boy had just transferred to my school, right? It was like in the middle of the year. Like he had just got to that school. And I was just like, oh, he's kind of cute. And then my friend was like, oh, he's kind of cute too. My friend had told one of his friends that he was cute. One of his friends was like, oh, she think you cute or whatever, you know, you know. You know how them like middle school relationships go. I think they exchange numbers or exchange Snapchats or whatever. So I, I just thought nothing of it. I always thought he was cute though. Not even gonna cap. A few days later, they started dating after they like talked the boy that was going out with my friend decided to text me in seventh grade i didn't know anything i didn't know how relationships went i didn't know how the talking stage went i didn't even know there was a talking stage i just thought you just get together with somebody one day and boom and then you break up with them later on like type stuff you know i'm pretty sure he texted me and started the conversation and then like i don't know how this came about but he was like oh i used to like you and i was like oh i used to think you were cute he was like well i kind of wanted you and not your friend and i'm like <laughs> I'm not even gonna give too much information out because ah, she still don't even know the story. Well, damn. He texted me this, all this on Instagram because we didn't have each other's numbers or nothing like that. But while this whole thing was happening, I did not tell my friend nothing. Like in elementary school when everybody used to call each other snitches and stuff and like a tattletale or whatever. I didn't want to be a tattletale, so I never told my friend. Now I know, I know right from wrong now. A few days went by after he had texted me that. But we didn't text anymore. Like after he texted me and said that he didn't want my friend and he wanted me, like, we didn't text anymore at all. We didn't even speak to each other. We low-key gave each other, like, weird looks. This is gonna sound so bad. I promise y'all. I promise y'all I'm not this type of person anymore. One day, my friend wasn't there at lunch. And, like, after lunch, we got to go, like, out in the quad area or whatever. And he had came up to me. And he was like, oh, where's blah, blah, blah? Meaning my friend. You know, his girlfriend. I was like, oh, she's not here. And he was like, oh, okay. He walks away, right? And I'm just sitting there with my friends talking to them. He comes back over there to me, like after he didn't ask me that question, and he was like, can I speak to you? And I was like, um, sure. And all my friends were looking like, boy, if you don't get- so He gonna bring me on the side of the school, not even the side, but like, you went to cram, you know where the health class was. And that's kind of where he brought me, kind of like behind everybody else, but not really. Like you could still see us, but like we wasn't that visible type stuff. It was like right here looking at me. And I was like right here looking at him. He was like, I like you. And I'm like, but you have a girlfriend. And he was like, yeah, I'm going to break up with her. But in my head, I'm like, whoa, like break up with her for me, for me. A white boy going to do it for me. So he freaking turns his head to me like this, like this. <laughs> I'm over here looking like, whoa, what the hell is you doing? So he turns his head and he's like, come here to me. And I'm like. Just sitting there stuck. I was like, Keisha. So I sat there for a few seconds and mind you, I did nothing with anybody. Like I barely talked to boys because I was a very shy person. He grabs my face. He grabs it like this, like pretend I'm him and you're me, right? So he goes like this, right, right, right. And I feel like it was in slow motion, bro. And I was like, I was like, I was low-key hyperventilating. So I was like the only one out of my friend group that didn't have their first kiss. So I was like, okay, like, well, I need to do this now. I need to do this. Like, I need to get this over with. Honestly, I didn't even think. I wasn't even thinking that he had a girlfriend and his girlfriend was my friend. So I go like this. Two. I was just like, like, honestly, I don't even think I closed my eyes. I didn't know how that worked. I didn't know how that worked. You know, after we did the little pet kiss or whatever, I freaking ran away. Hey! 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 Hey!
running why are you running? i did the dash i don't even know why since that little pet kiss or whatever i tried to avoid him every day at school i tried to freaking plan out my life without him in it like without seeing him because i felt like it would be awkward i made sure i didn't see him after school or before school i made sure of it he didn't have my number but he had my instagram and i blocked him on instagram after it happened but i know the question y'all are like wondering right now y'all probably wondering what happened to my friend like did my friend find out no she didn't find out he broke up with her a week after we kissed now that i think about it i'm just like girl how did you not tell your friend just messy just messy but yeah we're no longer friends like we kind of separated like during seventh grade kind of i don't know why it's just like mutual i think she still got me on snapchat though and you know i'll be promoting my youtube on snapchat so uh if she's watching this video hey girl i kissed your man <laughs> basically that's the end of my story time and my next story time video is gonna be on the most embarrassing day of my life make sure to tune in for my next story time please like comment subscribe and turn on your post notifications so that you know when i upload all my socials will be down below anyways bye keishas yeah. oh, peter piper, peter piper. Hey, baby mama fucking squad and she excited, she excited.